kidding me? Welcome. Oh, I am. Are you? What is the? Oh my God! It's not gonna. I can't run. I can't run. This one gotta be creepier, bro. Just look at that, bro. What is that? Is that supposed to be a cat? And the music? I'm already knowing, bro. In the aftermath of the train crash, you now find yourself stranded in the depths with a new goal in your sights. Ooh, that's bright. What's the time? Playtime! Finding critters? Yeah, it's kinda tough. The wind's really scary. <laughs> I can't sleep. Hey, we'll be okay, guys. I promise. All winds blow away. Eventually. Is this supposed to be a kid show? Catnap! Catnap, Please help us go to sleep, catnap! We need it, catnap! Please help us! Sleep! 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 <laughs> um. Okay. That's Everyone it? Everyone knows Huggy Wuggy and Poppy Playtime but are your children safe from Playtime Co.'s latest toy? What you've seen here is Playtime Co.'s own Smiling Critters, a limited series cartoon meant to celebrate the release of the toys sharing its name. Yet both now face the fire sparked by the inclusion of one key member. This is Catnap. And like the others of his line, you just pull his little tail and... seems innocent enough. However, parents across the country report their children experiencing strange and often violent nightmares. And beside them, their little grinning catnap doll. Now with controversy growing, Playtime Co. has announced the recall of all catnap toys from the Smiling Critters line. His image cleared from all promotional material. But damage already done Will disappearing be that easy? The exact cause I mean, even of these those look creepy, incidents bro. still unknown. Only one thing appears glaringly certain: your children are not safe with catnap. It's not us, right? Oh. That is definitely not us. The objective, find a way out. Is that closing in on us, bro? Oh, nah. Hold up. Bro, I literally just started. And I'm already dead. Um. Hello? Can I? Yeah, okay. And y'all giving me a trophy for that? It crashed in the trash compactor. Where the hell do I go? Um. Up here? Oh, this way? Hold up. It might be. It just might be. You know what, bruh? What other options do we got, right? It's been a few days since the first clip, hence why my voice sounds different. So I just wanted to clarify a little bit. I'm sick. I hope y'all could bear with me until it goes away. It's not too bad, but y'all could hear, like, my nose and shit. Anyways, let's get to it. Bruh, it has something to do with this door. I'm stupid. This was able to open this whole time. Bro, where's my flashlight? They really took my... Sh oh, 
this puddle, bro. I thought it was, I thought it was a hole. One thing I'm noticing off rip is that you can't like the running is weird now. Like I don't know if those, I don't remember in chapter two if it was a toggle, but now I have to like, like I'm walking right now. I gotta like press it or run, and then I gotta. Like, I gotta hold it for a little bit. And then I press it again to stop running. That's weird. I don't like that. That shit's gonna fuck me up so much. I already know it is. Come on. Come on. Oh, am I dead? No, I'm not. Okay. I'm dead. Bro, how was I supposed to know the smoke kills you? Well, I guess in the video. But still, that didn't tell me nothing. Go. 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 Oh, okay. So we just need to time this shit. That's what it is. Go. 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 No. No. Go. 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 Ah. Okay, cool. So these go down. And come back up. Okay. I got like what? Seven seconds? I got it. I got it. We got it. We chillin'. You suck! Go. We did it. Yes. We did it. Let's go. Oh. Hold up. I almost okay. Chill out, chill out. There we go. Are you kidding me, bro? I better not do that all over again. You have got to be kidding me. Kim's already hoeing me, bro. We just started. Oh, that. Okay, that did not pop up the first time. Maybe we were just too slow. Okay, hold it, hold it, hold it. Let go. Oh, that's what you do. Oh, I thought I saw something bad. Just tape, play it, play it, come on. All right, Miss Harper. Please tell explain us. the situation. Spare no detail. Well, like any night, all the children were hit to sleep. It was peaceful, quiet. Catnap had the red smoke. Catnap, the there it is. Then suddenly, there was this scream. Nightmares happen, I know, but this, I mean, dilated pupils and quivering lips. The way her eyes darted around the room, and I swear, her hand in mine, it felt like her blood was boiling beneath her skin. She saw something, too. Something horrible. She, uh, I, I'm sorry, I don't mean to. Miss Harper, we'll provide the very best care we can offer. You have my word, but this is important. Did Marie happen to describe what she saw? Yes, a monster, she said, said that it was colorless. Gosh, I could feel the poor little heart pounding. For her, it was right there. A and her movements, they were so wild. Arms flailing, legs kicking. Hmm. I, I wanted to talk to her. Is that the See video? how she's doing. I, I just, I really need to hear her voice right now. That would not be advised, Miss Harper. There are many concerns we must address at this time. But vital, show normal, and we'll continue to monitor. She'll be okay. No! Well, pardon me if I'm not comforted by that. <laughs> Just bring my little girl back to me. <laughs> Damn, the phone ring. How do I, how do I pick that up? I picked that up. Huh? How do we? Yeah, it's not letting me. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, wait, hold up. Why does it sound closer here? Bruh, I'm so done. Hey, hey, can you hear me? You look kind of lost. Who are you? Appreciate it. I don't know who you are, but I appreciate it. Whoa! Did you do that? I, um, I guess so. that's where Catnap found you. I know you're probably mad at Poppy for not letting you escape, but she needs you. For what? We need you. You are our mission. Together, we can save a lot of people, including you. Playcare is straight ahead. It's the home of anyway, Catnap. I 
I don't think we've seen something called Ollie, right? So is this like an actual person? I mean, whatever it is, I hope it's trusted. Hello. My name is Elliot Ludwig. When you look around at the world today, what one thing do you think it needs more of? I asked around once. Money. I never have enough. Understanding. I can never get any. Faith. The common man has lost it. Each answer was different. And I could perhaps see some little proof in each. But I think each was also missing something. Something simple. You see, not one of them could muster a smile. Bro, how deep are we? Are we underground? What the fuck? A smile is hope. A smile is love. A smile is understanding. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. For it is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One where they are protected. After all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile. They deserve to love. Taking us? And they deserve a safe home. That is why it is with enormous pleasure that as the founder of Playtime Co., I announce... Oh. Play Care. Oh, we made it. Our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that. Dude, I should... This does it's not a look school, safe. A playhouse. A place to belong. I saw the outside Our before. very own ecosystem beneath the surface. Oh, I do not want to be a kid living here. inch in detail to ensuring a child's smile. It's teachers and counselors, mothers and fathers, until such a time they have all of that in you. May play care bring joy. Inspiration and smiles to all who enter these doors. For what gives life its meaning if not a smile? Welcome to play care. Oh, you know, it's just better get real. What's this one at? Oh, it's me again. Oh, no. Cool place, right? The yeah, I don't know about that, Ollie. Oh, I see. I can give you a key down there. Alright, Ollie, where's the key at? Ah, here it is. To the gas production zone. So, you got the key. Okay. Now the question you're probably asking yourself is, where does it go? Well, head back out, and you should find a door just to the left of the cable car you took down here. Welcome to the gas production zone. Standard wire ring. Weapon hands is easy. This right here? Oh, we don't. Oh, and we got our flashlight back. First of all, air jets. How do I? How do I use it? Watch where you land. Okay, you switch with triangle. Thank you. No, thank you. Just give me a whole new upgrade. Bro, I'm really not built for these puzzles. I'm not even surprised if if it pops up. Generator. Good luck. 
Ollie, are you for real right now? Damn, so everything was fully dark. Where the key at, Ollie? Ah, there we go. It looks. I don't think we could, because if we go through, we're obviously gonna pass out. Right? No? can't do anything but walk. As of 9.45 a.m., local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late Elliot Ludwig, an esteemed toy maker and originator of the Playtime Company. At this time, an identity for the child awaits official confirmation. Found in an upstairs bedroom in a large duffel bag, officers on scene report that the remains appear to have been disturbed. Organs as well as key bones from the skeletal structure were reported missing from the body. The it is unknown at this time whether this extraction was, in fact, the cause of death. On recent events, I don't know why, but I feel like that's, that's for any all comment the... regarding the discovery. This is what they had to say. Quote, it's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man. And those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart for children like this one, making the actions of whoever planted this body all the more sick. We look forward to clear his good name, both in the public eye and in the eyes of the law. Stay tuned for more. Oh, here it is. Oh, come on, Ollie, don't tell me that, bro. <gasps> oh, no. Nah. Yeah, I can't do this, bro. That man was literally right there. Oh, bro. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence, many believe his reclusive and mysterious nature displayed over the previous decades lend suspicion to this claim. When questioned, Ludwig's neighbors indicated that he would often return to his home in strange hours of the night and depart again before sunrise. Some believed he was sick. Others that don't move. Oh. Don't move an inch. Yeah, Playtime Co., it seems, intends to keep Elliot's name within its brand regardless. What is sure to be a long legal battle will follow. I got chills right now. What the fuck? Is that? Oh. Nope. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Oh my god, bro. Are you kidding me? This one's actually creepy. The first two were okay. But this one? Nah, this one got it. But I mean, it's not like I could fucking play the tape. I don't have my arms. Oh, never mind. We don't need it. Play it. Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. Oh, okay. We're certain that in the days to come, That's you'll find playing. a new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls, sit yeah, in the mess for lunch, that. or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts' content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed, or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, Worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, may you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow. Their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic. Watching and waiting patiently for Yo, their I can't. turn at a warm oh, you're tripping. welcome. I literally can't turn. Or perhaps like, I hear they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you've left. 
world. A world that's theirs now. Welcome home. Oh, I am. Are you? What is the... Oh my god, go. I can't run. I can't run. What do you want me to do if I can't run? Okay, I think it was supposed to happen. Okay, it definitely was supposed to happen. Okay, I got open. <gasps> Bro, that damn achievement scared me. Is she good or is she bad? I can't, I can't interact with her. Is that her? I'd be fucked up and dark if that was actually her. Okay, let's go. She's not doing anything to me, so I'm chilling. Bro, if I have to do another puzzle, can't do it. I'm not smart enough. Okay, we're out. So no, no, let go! I didn't do anything wrong. Poppy? We're actually here to help. Is that the pink one? This place makes her tense. I'm glad that Ollie could help you get this far. He's the reason we found you at all. Bro, what does she look like that? So is this one good? Looks like the train crash hurt us both. You've been through so much. You deserve an explanation. Come on. Yeah, that's the least you could tell me, Poppy. Hey, you'll be okay. We'll be okay. I got so many questions, bro. Do I turn off this flashlight? Nope. So there's good and bad of whatever these are? Listen, I'm not your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. Why? What's happening down here is bigger than all of us. I need you, so we can get revenge on those monsters who tortured you, who tortured us. We didn't act alone. Well, why didn't you just say that? Cyphers, the original. You talking about catnap? Do the honors. Um. Sure, I guess. Oh, all the lights went on. Are you gonna say something? Oh. Prototype knows we're coming by now. If you try to escape. He'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god-awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you, how capable you are. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. You freed me. You are perfect for this. Nap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. So that's Can't not stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Um, are you gonna tell me where to go? No? Okay. Guess I'm on my own. Oh. That fast? Okay, I mean I ain't tripping. I ain't complaining. Hey, hey, it's me again. It's a good Ollie. It seems Pretty much. Power. Now the plan from here is pretty simple. Is it though? We need to restore power to the gas production zone. First, go back to the home sweet home building you were just in. Oh, great. You should be able to find a big power cord somewhere around the porch. Grab it and plug it in underneath the statue. 
Bro, this is what we're grabbing. Wow. I'm over here looking around the porch and shit. Looking, <laughs> I'm looking at the boom. Okay. So what we drag this? Damn, that's a long ass cord. So we drag this and we go down here. Cause you said we need to restore power, right? And it's down here. So home sweet home, right there. There's more. Everywhere is pretty dangerous around here. That playhouse especially. Yuck. So, your best bet is probably the school. Catnap usually leaves that place alone. Sending you the key now. Usually? 